All right, so everybody seems to like unboxings. I've got the AC Infinity Cloud Line. Uh, what is this? The S8. It's the S8. Uh, wifey just bought a laser cutter. And so we got this as the exhaust. Laser cutter will be here tomorrow. But everybody likes a good unboxing, so I thought uh, I'd just unbox this real quick. Honestly, personally, I'm not into unboxings. Um, but other people are, so whatever. <clears throat> All right, so right out of the top of the box, let's just do this. Let's slide that over there. What do you get here? You get the controller. Some instructions. Let's see what else is in here. A bag of clamps, screws, zip ties. fan unit a lot of people get the six inch I think the eight inch I'd have to look again at the numbers but I believe the eight inch flows twice as much um, roughly twice as much uh, I'll have to maybe I can put down here at the bottom of the video some actual numbers but when I was looking it was like 110 110 for um, the s6 and this was 169 on Amazon so I was like, you know what? Let's go with it. We'll go. Uh, we'll go with a little more oomph. So let's see. Let's plug her up. See what happens here. Is that in the frame? Man, yeah. Oh, it's already on. It's not even plugged up. Well, it's plugged. Woo! All right. It's running away. Don't suck this up. <clears throat> All right, so right out of the box, it came on at that speed. Now it's chilling out, now that I've got the, the brains connected. That was exciting. Let's ramp it up a bit. Is this in frame? All right, so that's full bore. You're about three feet from the camera. And it's loud, it, but it's not like uncomfortably loud, but you can tell it's running. And it is moving some air. I wish I had a cubic feet meter. Woo! All right, so it should turn off. It's definitely uh, a little noisy, but it's not bad. I'm gonna mount mine, mine'll be, I've got 12 foot ceilings, I'm gonna mount this as far away from the laser as I can. I think you wanna suck the air out rather than push the air out. So I'm gonna mount this uh, really close to the ceiling. All right, so I thought I'd do a quick test. Um, I'm standing six feet. You can see maybe right there. The camera is six feet from the fan. And I thought we'd see what it sounded like from back here. I've got the fan pointed at us, so the exhaust of the fan is is open to us. It's it's facing this direction. So let's see what it sounds like. Just get a baseline in here, quiet, no noise. And then obviously me talking, it jumps up into the 60s. All right, let's go one. And I'd call one almost uh, borderline. It, you can notice it, but just barely. It's not loud at all. Um, it's not as loud as like a fan in your bedroom or anything like that. It's, it's like you would know it was there maybe if someone told you or if you if you eventually heard it. But if there's anything 
You couldn't hear it over a normal conversation. If I were having a conversation, I wouldn't be able to hear it. Let's go two. Two again is noticeable from the uh, exhaust end, but I'm six feet away. It's hitting a workbench of mine and I can feel the breeze off of it. So that's moving a decent amount of air. Go three. Four. There's a substantial difference between three and four. And I can definitely feel the wind over here. Five. Six. Six is, uh, I won't call it loud, but it's noisy. It's, you would definitely walk in a room and know it's going. Um, yeah, you can hear it for sure. Seven. Can hear it. No problem. You can still, you can have a conversation over it, but you're both going to have to speak up. And if you, you know, you're going to have to speak up. There's eight. And you can see this little piece of leftover tassel. It's uh, in the floor, probably four feet away from the fan and it's blowing all over the place. That's putting out some air. But it's still not super loud. Uh, you wouldn't want this in your bedroom while you're trying to sleep. But if you're exhausting air from a laser or something like that, this wouldn't be probably intolerable. Alrighty. So that's really all I've got. If you have any questions about it, I'd be happy to try something, test something out for you guys. Alright then. Bye-bye.